Hello guys, welcome back to Not Enough Toys. Today we are going to look at the new Polly Pocket Cactus Cowgirl Ranch. So this is a new release in the year 2020. It is actually trademarked as 2019. So let's look at the front of the box first. And the back. On the back of the card, they show the other compacts in the same wave. Well, we've got some of these and we will be showing you guys in our videos to come. So stay tuned. Now let's get it out. Alright, so first let's have a good look at the outer shell. So it's in the shape of a cactus with flowers and little hearts along the cactus. Comes with a little wristlet that has a locking pop beat kind of mechanism. The kind that we used to have on our vintage toys. So I really like this. And here's the back of the compact. These two parts are actually hollow. And here's the marking showing the year and where it's made. So on the very top of the cactus, there's the lock with the Polly Pocket medal. So you can't open it like this or just holding on to the button. You actually have to push the medal to open it. Now let's look at the hinges. So once you open it up, it stands up right at 90 degrees. You can lay it flat as well. But the catch is at 90 degrees. Alright, so now let's look at the accessories. This is the poly stick stickers that came with the set. So they have stickers that are related to the scene. We have the Lucky Horseshoe and also the Cactus. The set comes with two dolls and this is the Polly doll. She comes in a green t-shirt with her favourite horse printed on it. And her hairstyle is very different. She has some bangs and at the back she even has braids. Super cute. And this is Polly's friend. She's wearing glasses and have pom-pom hairs. She has this checkered pink shirt. So the set also comes with two horses and this is the white one. Their eyes are printed on. And the middle of their bodies are actually squashed so that it's easier to sit your poly on when they want to ride their ponies. And this is the black horse. So the significant difference between the two of them is actually the posture of their legs. So as you can see here, you can see four legs and here you actually only see three because the black one also stands on its hind legs. But it is also possible to let it stand on force. So overall, the compact is giving me a wow wow west kind of vibe. And the bottom part looks like a horse stable to take care of the horses. Now for my favourite part to look at all the moving mechanism in the compact. At the very top, there's a lizard over here. And if you push it down, the cactus goes down. And if you push it up, the cactus reveal a bit more. The hot air balloon moves up and down. And has a locking mechanism right at the very top. But I find that it's actually able to stay at whichever position that you want, even without the lock. 
The hot air balloon also comes with a slot, so we'll try to put the poly in later. The barn door opens. And you can see the cow eating grass much more clearer with some hay inside. And at the back of the door, there's detailing like saddles, trophies, medals. So at the bottom of the compact, we have this part with a moving purple piece. It looks kind of like a fence. So also, we are not too sure what this is, but we are guessing that it's actually a hurdle for the horses to practice for their shows. So this part is how they position it in the packaging and at first I thought this is a fixture but look it. You can move it and it extends all the way out. So once you close it up, it's actually a full ring. And there's a horse inside here, it's a brown one but it's attached to this barrel. And the barrel has a little heart on it. So you can spin the horse around. And Polly can ride on the horse as well. So fun thing that I found out was that because it was originally positioned like this. So I was just trying out to move the horse and BAM! It went through like an obstacle course. So it's actually quite cute. You can also play with it like this. Alright, so now let's look at some really really zoom in close-ups that you might have missed when you look at the images online. For the hot air balloon, they actually had a 3D detailing for the sandbag that they bring it up with them during their hot air balloon ride. On the top of the compact, you can see many hot air balloons at the back. For the bottom of the compact, there are actually silver hoofs prints on the floor all over the track. There are two buckets of apples for the horses. There's a place for them to drink water from. The seats for Polly and her friends are actually made of hay. And they have detailings on all the walls for the bottom part of the compact. Let's look at them. So mainly they are cactus, hay, and this part is actually additional fence, so it looks like a full ring. So I've always wondered if let's say the old playset and the new playsets, can they actually blend together and complement each other so here's a comparison of all the horses that i have on hand these are the new ones from this set and i have three vintage ones including a unicorn and this tiny little unicorn actually came from the new set that is called unicorn utopia so i have that video on our channel and you can go check it out if you want to see in detail so first up the size difference the new horses are actually much longer and are relatively bigger. If you see it from the front, you can see that the new horse is actually super thin and super flat. So lastly, we don't even have to compare. The new unicorn from the Utopia is simply the smallest, tiniest horse among all of them. I also have with me some of the vintage polys that are meant to ride horses. So we'll see how it works out with the new horses and our vintage polys. Alright, so here's a photo of the dolls that I've mixed up with the horses. So I've tried putting them on and off and I realized that the new dolls will fit both on the old and the new horses. Well, for the old dolls, it can fit on the unicorn from the Unicorn Utopia really, really nicely. I barely made one of it sit on the new black horse that came in this playset and it's not stable. 
meaning that it can only be on there for a photo and that's the only angle I can get it to be at the poly doll will not stay on the horse so scale wise I think it's pretty good the vintage one fit in pretty well I will be including some pictures that I took at the near the end of the video so you can take a look on how they fit in and blend for the hot air balloon part this is how the doll will look like they are sort of leaning forward but if you look from the front it's actually quite okay the vintage poly fit in as well so now the question can the new horse fit in a vintage set so i have here the black horse it can stand in the room of the unicorn but you can't shut it tight because it's too tall but the little unicorn from the unicorn utopia because it's really tiny and short can fit inside all right so through playing with this playset now i have a few new poly pocket dolls i realized that there are dolls with different types of bottoms so there's the shorts kind the skirt and the kind that has smooth long pants so i realized that only the dolls with shorts fit really really well into the holes and sit like they're supposed to where the skirt can't even fit in and the long pants look like they are half standing half sitting so Mattel if you are watching this maybe you want to consider making more of your dolls if you want to continue with this jelly like dolls then you might want to look into this mold this is the best mold so far to fit in the chest so overall I really love this set it's very very cute with the two in fact three horses is my first ranch poly pocket set so it's very cute you can take care of the horses you can ride the horses out and the moving mechanism was actually more than what i expected from the online images so i'm really surprised now i'm gonna include some pictures that i've taken and hopefully in the pictures you can see more detailed parts of the compact and how the different dolls blend together and have fun together you know so all right and that's it we'll be looking into all my collection in the coming videos and yep that means more poly pocket and little secrets so i'll see you next time bye